Welcome to the Heart and Mind Hub, parents and educators. Thank you for taking the time to invest in you and your community's emotional wellness and social emotional health. I am your facilitator, uh, also known as the breathing teacher, and I am really excited to bring these resources to you. Uh, this is the course page. You'll see that there are eight brain aligned and trauma informed modules, all designed to build connection and community and you get a certificate of completion at the end. Feel free to use this certificate on your professional development uh, evaluation rubrics and hopefully that can really help you to demonstrate that you are growing and investing in yourself. And just a broad stroke of what's included is 60 activities, videos, presentations, workbooks, all designed to help you increase emotional resilience, self-awareness, and healthy coping. You'll be able to implement these practices in your homes and communities. And the knowledge is foundational, but taught to you in an accessible and bite-sized way so that you can share it with confidence. All of the practices are designed to help decrease stress and anxiety and increase healthy coping. You'll also learn how to put these ideas into practice and action and build a stronger community and climate, whether at home or at school. I'd like to now take you through some of the modules. So as you can see, this is the sharing norms and ways to create shared norms for your community. And this is always the first part of anything that I teach is laying down those ground rules. So for example, in the shared norms activity and script, you'll get a full scripted lesson plan for how I would approach sharing those classroom norms. You'll also receive some strategies on implementing consistent procedures, and you'll even get an example of a classroom norms poster. Some of my do's and don'ts, and then an icebreaker bingo question are also included. As a bonus, you will be getting the 80 days of SEL workbook, which is kind of crazy, but it is literally 80 days of SEL activities there are breath practices, worksheets, things that you can give for mindful coloring, self-awareness tools. I mean, like this in itself is so valuable and you can just literally done for you, print and teach. You don't need any prep to do these. The second module is all about self-awareness, emotions and checking in. So one of my favorite and most um, exciting offerings here is my introduction to the sensory um, chart that you're going to get. And it also comes with a companion video so you know exactly how to teach it explicitly. And you're also going to get another special uh, chart that I worked with a graphic designer to create on the polyvagal theory. And that one also comes with a companion video. You'll also see that there is one that is specifically for educators and adults, and that one is um, going to be linked as well. Module three is all about social awareness. So really building those skills around empathy, interpersonal connections. There is a middle school to high school age and then a lower L social awareness activity. So these two are scaffolded for those two different grades. There's also a worksheet on stopping cyberbullying and then one on building multicultural and celebrating the different diversity in your classroom or at home. Number four is all about self-care. So grounding practices for self-care. There is a containment practice that you'll be able to listen to there's a self-care inventory. There are two breathing exercise videos and a whole presentation. If you, if you wanted to use this um, presentation for a parent night, if you wanted to work with other educators on this presentation as well, it is all gonna be hyperlinked and it'll pop up 
and populate for you. It looks like it's just taken its sweet time. But that little clip there means that it is a presentation. Here it is. So you'll be able to just cue this up wherever you are and the whole presentation will be available to you. And it also comes with a companion workbook. So anytime you see a paper clip, that means that the item is downloadable. Module five focuses on trauma-informed care and incorporating body sensations, understanding how to look for those body sensations. So this is one of my favorite foundational activities to use. Comes with instructions, a guided body scan, and then of course, the activity to follow. This one has a lot of resources and they do come with companion audios. You'll also be able to see some of my favorite resources hyperlinked if you wanted to add any of them to your classroom. And then this is a two by 10 relationship building tracker. Module six is focusing on building relationships to a thriving community. So lots of protocols on restorative justice. Um, you're gonna find another personalized feelings chart that I created with another, with a designer. Um, and also if you wanted to do a family SEL night, there is a presentation and a sign-in sheet as well. Module seven and eight are about self-management and anger management. So we're focusing on the SEL competency of self-management. And here is where you're gonna find ways to incorporate a peace corner or an amygdala reset corner, either in your home or your classroom along with a companion video. You can just queue it up and let the kids do their thing. There's also a presentation if you wanted to um, teach this to your staff on preventative discipline and it's in a bite-sized way um, around the different nervous system responses. I had specific requests for prioritization tools and smart goal trackers, so those are also included as well. And the anger management is going to include building calming corners, um, helping to manage rage. It's going to come with two different triggers surveys. This is one of my favorite activities. It is a, uh, it's a fun game that kids like to play. It involves using Skittles. And so it's a fun little anger game. You can get some Skittles and they'll get real excited to talk about anger. There's some tapping. And then when you're all done, you're able to print off your certificate and use that for professional development. Um, if you have any questions on any of the module and how it can support you in your community, please feel free to reach out and I hope you love it just as much as I do.